Good morning. Subject name here. We're about to undergo a series of tests involving quantum tunnels, exotic matter, asbestos, and acid slash base related chemistry. You yourself will be tested in relation to your abilities to survive in extremely tense situations and to resist the temptation to drink salt water. I am your test supervisor. Supervisor me here. I will guide you through each test. The portal in your relaxation vault will now open and the test will commence. some portals. See if you can figure out how they work. Very good. You know how portals work. You also seem to understand that jumping in acid is a bad idea. Here's the next chamber. If you can't solve it yourself, I will be very disappointed. In this chamber, you will acquire an Aperture Science handheld portal device. This will give you a degree of control over the testing environment's portal placement. You have the device. You can create your own green portal and use its zero point energy field. Okay, here I'm introducing the Aperture Science High Energy Pellet, also known as the Combine Ball. See, that money was just rest. Interesting fact about these pellets. Their interaction with portals creates a sort of so-called super resonance, theoretically. These funnels are made of liquid asbestos. Don't worry, long problems associated with asbestos come from dust, which exists only with solid asbestos. You may have noticed that the do not know you're trapped behind the glass. I'll send someone to break that for you. Here we have the Aperture Island Asbestos Remover. It is designed to liquefy and emancipate asbestos insulation in buildings. Okay, I wasn't being truthful when I said this test would be unmonitored. It was part of judging your reaction. This test involves the use of momentum with portals. See if you can get across this acid pit. Good. This is the Aperture Science Aerial Vape Plate. The idea is to trust that it will send you where you need to go. Oops. Sorry about that accident. I thought I had that platform checked. I... Whoa! You, you know, I think you've done enough for this test. Here's a shortcut to the exit. Here is my pride and joy, the exotic matter cube. It can hold and store combo. Well done.
this chamber was originally designed to test the effect of moving asbestos cones on types of exotic matter. Luckily for you, all energy ball launchers Don't get caught in laser fumes, it will vaporize you on hunt. Excellent! Did you know that the number 13 is traditionally associated with bad luck? You seem to have proven that. You can create an infinite loop with portals. Seeing as you know how portals affect momentum, you can figure out this chamber. Excellent! This is a nice chamber. I used to bet test subjects that they couldn't leave the test chamber without their heads spinning. However, I kept making cake that no one could eat, so now I wanted to... Okay, this chamber has to be sealed due to a recent radiation leak. Unfortunately, regulations prevent me from moving you to the next one. You will need to take this path through some maintenance areas to reach Chamber 17. You may proceed. We haven't armed out all the keeps in the sentry turrets yet. Exposure to highly basic substances completely ruins their systems. You may use this information to your advantage. The final test. You know what that means. Okay lady, that's quite enough. As you can probably tell by the red lights and alarms, you are I am not letting you in that elevator. No bloody way. Well, wasn't that a clever little override the engineers stuck in? This is Test Chamber 16. Well, this is my tool. That core was stopping me from forming relations with a hostile alien race known as the CMB R Combine. Of course, I already had the relations made. Now all I need to know, that's sad. Anyway, shouldn't you be blowing up more parts of me? Hmm, that core was stopping me from forming relations with a hostile alien race known as the CF. Fair play to you. Thanks to you. Aperture Island and its evil artificial intelligence are no more. We are Vortigaunts of the former slave race of the border world. After generations of pointless toil and sacrifice, we finally won our freedom at the hands of one free man at Black Mesa a few months ago. But by destroying Aperture Island, you have helped to save the future of man and Vortikind. And for that, we congratulate you most sincerely.